All right, Chef Ryan joining us now from Down River Grill. And we want to talk Spokane Restaurant Week um, again. again um, it's, it started last Friday yeah. through the weekend, and how's it been going? Uh, it's been going really good for us. It's been really exciting to offer a different kind of menu to our regular guests that come mm -hmm. in. And then to be, ever, or to be able to offer the menu to new guests. And that's the whole point of Restaurant Week. Is to try and get some people back in or newbies coming in. What, what do we have? On your menu, you start with a salad. It, this is a dynamite salad. What do we got? So this is a roasted golden beet salad with okay. goat cheese, balsamic croutons, and then a lemon thyme vinaigrette. And this okay. is what we feature to start our Restaurant Week menu. All right, let's put it together. By the way, I never would have thought I'd have... Go ahead and start assembling, whatever you we it. need to do. Um, I never thought I'd ever try a golden beet, and it was Chef Ryan that said, you know, to really shut up and try it. You know, and I said, okay, and it was good. <laughs> he didn't say shut up. I'm just trying we to help your those. health out a little bit. I know. But beets have to be healthier than some of the other stuff I've eaten. But now that Twinkies are coming back on, I think I'm going to have to step they're making, up. They're maybe. making a break for it. Well, I'm hoping. All right, so uh, again, we've got just a lot of the simple things. We've got some good onion. We've got, uh, again, some um, mustard. Is that? Yep, so i got some Dijon mustard, apple okay. cider vinegar, apple juice. Can I stir? Yes, please. I want to be, you know. All right, so now what do we do? So at this point, we just want to make sure we get all these base liquids. Okay. Uh, really mixed in, get that flavor started there. And then we're going to slowly drizzle in oil as we oh, mix. Oh, drizzle. Drizzle and I'll mix. You Go got ahead. It. All right, so. So we're going to start with some canola. Okay, a little canola. Now, what about Spokane Restaurant Week? Let's continue to talk about this. Have you had any surprises as to, to people coming in saying, oh, my goodness, because yours is 28 bucks, but right. it's a great value. Uh, we've had people that were really impressed with, again, the value, but also that they got to come in, experience a course dinner uh, with really no effort. We don't do through course dinners in America a lot. You don't you know? see it as much. I mean, in the bigger food cities, there's a little bit more establishment already built towards yeah. those course dinners. And Spokane Restaurant Week's really great in that it just allows the general customer to experience that. And yeah. to Chef, do you just hire one person to do this all night? Is this... <laughs> More or less, yeah. Because now I don't need to go How's to the your shoulder gym. feeling, yeah. yeah? I know. This is sort of a workout. Um, yeah, you can come back later and do the whipped cream. So, oh. <laughs> That's funny. All right, we're going to continue to do this. We're going to build. We're going to have more with Down River Grill. I'm going to... Uh, I can't do... I don't think I can do this left-handed. And um, I just... We're thanking Derek Dice for making the call. Uh, so <laughs> this salad that we started to make yeah. is right here. <laughs> This is part of Spokane Restaurant Week. Right. And you guys have been doing this since last Friday. Thumbs up. Has it gone well for you guys? It's gone really well. We've okay. seen the biggest influx of customers on the weekends when uh, you know, people are coming out, you know, and they just use this as another reason for them to have a really good opportunity to go out, eat, spend more than maybe they would, and, you know, definitely get a much more... Much a lot more of value. For their dollar. A lot of value. A lot of value at twenty-eight dollars. That's your price point. Twenty-eight bucks, three courses per person. Yeah, lots of restaurants are doing it for either eighteen or twenty-eight. And right. All the menus are great. It's a good opportunity for us as restaurants to further ourselves as a community and to really and put your best, push that thing. Put your best food forward. Exactly. As it were. This is a, a fresh greens, uh, beautiful cheese, and, and again, it's got the. Help me. So we've got some roasted golden beets. Oh, so let's go ahead and get some of those in, probably about half. Half? I'm just gonna do this because I don't have gloves. Perfect. Okay, I'm just gonna pour it in there. We what got we balsamic got? croutons there, so go ahead and take those and just kind of break them up in your hand and pop them on top. Okay, well this is for the crew, right? I've washed my hands. We're all good with that? I trust you. You trust, trust me? Him. Okay, very nice. It's like cooking Robin's it Robin's kind of glaring at you, but yeah, Derek's well, yeah. got your back. I did. I... So Perfect, we got a little bit more this. in there. Put yep. a little bit more in there. You, you get to do the cheese. I will do the cheese. You've got the gloves. <laughs> All right, now what are you starting over here? So over here, I'm working uh, just some stuff that we have for the port demi sauce that we're gonna do with our flat iron. So this is a sauteed mushroom port demi. Okay. And you want to deglaze that with some red wine. And of course you do. Oh, of course you do. And it's not six in the morning. It's not five in the morning. No, but it's always the, wine o'clock. But still, the axiom holds true. If you won't drink it, don't cook with it. Exactly. So we're using actually the DRG Relentless in this one. <laughs> Very nice. They have I their know. own wine. All right. And so then we've got uh, fresh veggies that you've. Uh... Yep, we got some fresh veggies there. And then this is a little bit of a reduced uh, demi sauce that I brought in. I'm just gonna kind of nice. Just touch that one up a little bit for us. So we're gonna let that slowly come down, and then we'll finish that with a little bit of healthy butter. Healthy butter. Oh. You know, butter is, by the way, relatively again in moderation, heart healthy. They keep going it back is. and forth. Now we're back into the it's good. 
which is I'm grateful. It is. Um, We're going to add some green onions to our salad as well. All right, that is absolutely we gorgeous. We got the other things in there. And then we have two different kinds of goat cheese. We have a fresh goat cheese that uh, you can get from any grocery store. And then we have a hard goat cheese from Quillasasket. Okay, Quillasasket. Are and they then, in the state? <laughs> yeah. Okay, I thought that was funny. Um, and then this is the vinaigrette we made, which yeah. is a lemon thyme vinaigrette. And it's okay. absolutely, when you pour it on, you see the lemon, you know you get that feeling in the back, right? Right there, that's perfect. I love that. That looks absolutely delicious. Just give it a little bit of a quick toss. A little toss and it's good to go. Good to oh, go. Man, that's wonderful. All right, coming up, we're going to uh, finish out the flat iron steak coming up in about a half an hour. The salad could be perused before we get there. We're gonna eat on that. It's gonna be wonderful. Uh, Spokane Restaurant Week through Sunday. We'll have more coming up here on Good Morning Northwest. Chef Ryan joining us now, Downriver Grill. As we celebrate and have been talking about Spokane Restaurant Week, your opportunity to go out and either revisit a restaurant you haven't been to for a while or yeah. try something brand new. So there's about 52 different restaurants participating in Restaurant Week. So you have a lot of selections. A lot of these are gonna be your mm -hmm. favorite restaurants that you already go to. Some of you may have never been to. Yeah. There's a lot of options out there. I urge you to maybe try something that, uh, if you haven't been there for six months or a year, Go check it out. If it's something that you've heard about, then maybe that's something you want to try out as well. Um, two price points, $18 for about half of them. The others are 20, you're at 28. We're at 28, right. Okay, but you're getting almost $40 worth of value in there. You want them to if say, here, to, this is what we offer. Exactly, if you were to offer or order the exact same things that we are doing or a menu equivalent, you'd be looking at a $40 bill just for yourself. Right. So $28 gives you all that. But they're gonna be taking food home. Because that salad is huge. <laughs> we get a lot of we get a lot of uh, of our tiramisu's to go. All right, the flat iron steak. Tell so me about this. So we have this. got this is our flat iron steak, and so we've got some mushroom port demi, some vegetables, uh, pan seared flat iron steak, and then a house potato gratin. Which all right, the the house potato is called maize. Maize. Not because it's corn, but because of Aunt May's recipe. Right. So this is a recipe given to the Down River Grill from Jonathan's Aunt May. Right. And this is something they started in the restaurant. They needed a kind of a house potato and you know, they had this, they always had it at their family gatherings. Right. Down River Grill's a family, you know, it fit to start and they just needed something and it's something that has stayed with the grill and it's become branded into the grill as something that we use, we love, our guests love, and yeah. we come in for it because specifically it's, for it. It's comfort food. It's and I say this and Derek goes again with the comfort food, but I'm telling you. <laughs> He's thinking of this, this the same way right now. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna turn, is that all right? Yeah. Can I jump in? Yeah, definitely get in I there. love the fact that you cook these hot, quick. So here's- Small, that's so another thing. So we've got some Brussels in here. Brussels aren't Can gonna cook. Can I show cook. this? Yeah. Go ahead. So the Brussels aren't gonna cook at the same time as those other smaller vegetables. So those are blanched and chilled along with the butternut squash that's in there. Mm -hmm. Then the zucchini, the peppers, and the onions, they're quite a bit smaller, those will cook at the same time since we put a little bit of pre-cooking on those brussels. All right, and so therefore you're still gonna get a crisp but uniformly throughout it. It's not, right. I hate it when the vegetables are cooked to the point where it falls apart. No right. one likes that. You don't that. want that. You want them to be a little something called al dente, which means to mm -hmm. the tooth. So you bite into it, it has a small little bit of resistance, you yep. bite through it, and then you get a nice cooked vegetable. All right, well we are gonna put this food to the tooth. <laughs> All of them, 32. For some less, for some more, depending. Uh, coming up here, on Good Morning Northwest. Again, Down River Grill, part of Spokane Restaurant Week. You can go to KXOI.com to get more. Chef, how are we doing? We're doing well. Should we get some plating done here? Please. So, uh, we're talking about Spokane Restaurant Week. Continue. I'll, I'll just talk while you do your thing. You got it. So, um, this is our house potato gratin. Okay, very nice. Got a little bit of the vegetables there that we cooked up. And again, you know, when you're uh, at a restaurant, the first thing you see should be appetizing because you really taste with your eyes the first thing you do. You do. Um, and a lot of colors, I love that. You know, that's a really good way to just cook healthy is have a lot of colors on your plate. If you're not too sure about the nutrition value and things. Just make it bright? Have some colors. Get some <laughs> colors in there. Cook them. I'm not sure if it's healthy, it's... but I'm eating neon. It's perfect. <laughs> it looks beautiful. It does. So you have a lot of flavors going on here. They, they sort of blend because you've got a gravy, you've got the meat and the flat iron steak and the gravy. potatoes. Not gravy. Oh, what is I it called? I gotta stop you no, there. <laughs> well, sorry, that's the inner me speaking probably. What do you call it? This is our uh, mushroom port demi sauce that we have with our flat iron steak. Okay, excellent. Is it good over potatoes? Uh, it goes great with potatoes. I had a feeling. 
<laughs> All right. Um, this There's far is, more than 11 secret spices. I know. It, it, <laughs> it, it smells absolutely wonderful. One of the beautiful things about this is that we do have it here. Let me, let me hold that up. This is Spokane Restaurant Week. 52 restaurants around our area uh, in our region have all taken part in Spokane Restaurant Week that goes through this Sunday. You're a part of that. We're um, happy to be a part of it. It's the first time Spokane's ever done Spokane Restaurant Week. We got asked to do it and we jumped on the opportunity. And it's been huge. It's been huge. It's a great opportunity for restaurants to promote themselves, to promote our community, to identify what Spokane is opposed to focusing on what it isn't. That's right. And a lot of times... So positive. So look positive. At you. It's true. A it's lot of the times coffee. they look towards... It's the coffee, and I've had a lot of it. We, we have to go. How <laughs> unconvenient. <laughs> okay. Tiramisu, the beautiful <clears throat> salad, and the flat iron steak, all for $28. Uh, <laughs> other restaurants have an $18 price point. You want to know more, go to kxy.com, and we've got it all there for you.